Josh, a frustrating one this afternoon, just didn't go our way today. No, I think, you know, um, we've got to take the good things, I think especially the second half, the way we moved the ball, but first half just wasn't good enough really, um, individually. Um, just, yeah, really poor, I think. Um, not pointing fingers at anyone, but, you know, I, I've got to be better. Um, and I think we all agree as a team that we've just got to be better. Um, and then, obviously, they scored the goal, took us into the second half, and, you know, we were all over them, but just couldn't, we couldn't put it to bed um, and get, get that goal back. So, yeah, disappointed. It's another game, really, a bit, a bit like Tuesday, where we were punished for a slow start. Yeah, I agree. We've, we've got to do something to, to start differently because we've often started the games, um, you know, where we've, we've conceded early and, you know, that's, that's nothing to do with, with the staff or anyone, that's to do with the players on the pitch. Um, and there's something we've got to sort of kick ourselves before the games, uh, before the game starts and, you know, try and, try and get on top in the first half rather than, you know, having to fight back because we've done it enough and we know we can come back, but you don't want to go there in the first place. So, yeah, frustrating. Manager said that some of the players out there looked a bit, a bit leggy today. Do you think that's probably consecutive Saturday, Tuesdays for so long taking its toll a little bit? I think so. Um, again, I don't want to use the excuses, but I think, like, we're, we're obviously a young team. We've, we've got the legs to do it, but um, it does definitely, from going just from Saturday each week to then Saturday, Tuesday, uh, it does take it out of you. Um, and especially, you know, the conditions weren't bad today, but when we're playing in the wind and things, it, it does, people don't realise it does really take it out of you. So we've just got to sort of recuperate. We've been given um, given a couple of days off, so we just got to go home, relax and recuperate and get back to our uh, winning ways. And really, it's times like this when you have lost a few games that you really find out a bit more about each other and about the team. Cause it, it can be so easy when you're winning to, yeah. to, to just think, oh, everything's great. Yeah, I, Gaffer said it, he said, you know, when we were in those 20 games, you know, that's not when you, you need to look at your character. You need to look at your character when you're going through through the tough times like now. So character will show now and we have to really pick ourselves up and um, show what we're about really because we've got great character in the team. It's just trying to show it. So we've got to, you know, work together, pick each other up and just go again. Obviously, it's a big couple of weeks really. It's Swindon, Port yeah. Vale, Forest Green, Sutton, <laughs> all, all the next four league games. It can look daunting when you look at the table, but actually, yeah. you know, like you said, it's time to show some character. Really. Exactly. I think... You know, we'll, we'll look at those games and we'll take them as a challenge saying, you know, we, we can compete with these with these teams. Um, and, you know, sometimes, you know, when you feel like it's not going your way, you just you sort of need that. That I don't know what the word is, but um, we're not underdogs, but you need that sort of those tough games to really get you back, back like going. I don't know how to describe it really, but so, um, yeah, you, you need them to get you going. So I think I think they'll come in our favour. Um, yeah.